Last year, Kansas Legal Service attorneys helped over 19,000 Kansans, including the elderly, disabled, and other vulnerable individuals in all 105 counties. Along with that, we received over 740,000 unique visitors interested in our services on our website. In 2022 alone, 905 hours of legal services provided at no cost to 584 clients from 66 private attorneys through the KLS Pro Bono program were served. 1,044 victims of domestic violence obtained a final protection from abuse order through the representation of a KLS advocate. 1,421 veterans or their families received legal advice or representation. And 10,505 clients received timely legal advice as they faced family law, housing, consumer-related, or other crises in their lives. The United Way of Greater Kansas City listed Kansas Legal Services on its 2023 Impact 100 list. This list is a diverse group of 100 community partners that the United Way of Greater Kansas City believes are addressing the most vital health and human service needs. Every Impact 100 organization maintains a high bar of organizational accountability and effectiveness in terms of finance, accountability, governance, and impact in the community. Kansas Legal Services also has a 100% ranking from Charity Navigator. Charity Navigator uses data from the IRS, partners, and the charities themselves to power an unbiased analysis of a charity's impact within a community. I went down to the Wanda County Courthouse. I had a few illegal issues going on with my tra traffic tickets. I really didn't have any help, so I found an attorney on the third floor. And he helped me a whole lot. I work at Freddy's, and it would have been impossible for me to have gotten all these fines and tickets and illegal issues paid and taken care of for me in order for me to succeed in a better future was me having a transportation, getting back and forth, and just making sure I have a daily routine of living like everyone else. So I just got one speeding ticket, and... Basically, I just didn't do, deal with it and just kept on getting them. They were suspending my licenses, so it just kept on building up and driving without a you know, license, with a suspended license. It was just getting worse and worse. So once I got with um, Kansas Legal Services, um, they were able to pretty much just clear my whole record in Kansas and it was really good. I think my record was kind of making me a little down. It actually was affecting my mood and the way I was feeling. So I just feel a lot happier being having the um, weight of my record being off my back and I'm just doing a lot better in life and I'm really happy. I didn't think that um, having that record on me was making me feel so I guess depressed. I don't want to say depressed, but actually depressed. Like it actually lifted a lot of depression off of me. So I just look at it. <laughs> I really appreciate Kansas Legal Services. I uh, live in a trailer park in Kansas City, Kansas. And um, I've been there 14 years. And uh, the manager came by seeing it. She wrote me up. Fine, I'll get it cleaned up. And at the same time, it was uh, spring cleanup. We're supposed to get rid of all everything that we want to get rid of with the dumpster in the storage lot. Um, there was no dumpster in the storage lot, so I figured, well, while I'm putting in these car parts in the shed, I may as well dig my riding lawnmower out, and it's all the way in the very back. Okay, so I'm digging them out. Next thing I know, I get another letter. Said, uh, second notice, get that stuff cleaned up out of your yard. Well, I clean the stuff up every night. Once it got laid, when I felt it was, I needed to stop making noise outside, I would put everything back in, no matter how it was there, and close the shed doors and go in. And she comes up and finds me a $50 fine for not having everything picked up. And before that, I'd went to the office and asked the lady, I said, look, I mean, I'm cleaning out my shed, digging out the riding lawnmower. Now, am I going to get a write-up every time you drive by and see stuff out in my yard? She didn't like it too well that I bucked heads with her on it. And she uh, handed me a 60-day eviction notice. Uh, but then next thing I know, I get a, a guy at the door with an actual appearing court for eviction. Um, I go to court. Didn't have an attorney at first. And a guy from Kansas Legal Aid stepped up, said he'd take the case. And... 
lawyer, he helped me out. He did talking to him, and next thing I know, uh, the uh, park manager called me and says, you can stay. And it's all thanks to the, the legal help from Kansas Legal Aid. I mean, I don't know what I've done without it. I really appreciate what you guys have done. And um, I really wouldn't have nowhere to go if it wasn't for you guys. Be honest, and that's the truth.